Now on July 30th, Apple announced a 4 for 1 stock split. And that upcoming stock split was the fifth major stock split in the company's history. And now Tesla is pulling a similar move with a 5 for 1 stock split, which was announced on August 11th after market hours. And the split goes into effect on August 31st. So in this video today, we will go over what this means for investors, what the heck a stock split is. And if you stick to the very end, you'll know whether you should wait to buy Tesla shares after the split happens or if you should buy Tesla shares now, right after you hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. And I'm actually super excited to make this video today. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. Let's get started with the video. So if you already know what a stock split is, you can actually skip the very first part of this video. Now a stock split is a corporate action that happens when a company decides to split its stock into more stock. The number of stocks in a company increases, but the price of that stock actually decreases. Also during a stock split, there is no change in the market capitalization of the company or the value of the stock that you own in the company. Think of it like this. Think of it like slicing an apple, no pun intended. Cutting an apple and dividing it up into smaller slices does not mean you have less apple, just smaller slices of apple. Take for example, again, no pun intended, the apple four for one stock split. So now let's say that apple shares stay at a price of $441 you may stay there, it may go higher, it may go lower, no one really knows yet. But on August 23rd, each Apple shareholder will receive three additional Apple stocks for each Apple stock held on the record date. Now this means that after the stock split date, each shareholder will have four Apple stocks worth at around $110 each for each stock they previously held. However, the value of the company remains untouched. So remember, the only thing that changes here is the number of stocks that you will be holding. But the Tesla stock split is a little bit different. This will be a five for one stock split. Now, I don't know about you, but it comes to no surprise that they actually decided to make that stock split happen. Tesla has been on a crazy rally, especially this past year, making it super hard for new investors to buy one Tesla stock. Now, it wasn't too long ago that Tesla was trading at around $211 last year. Now, and now the company is trading at around $1,485. That's crazy, which makes Tesla worth $250 billion, which also makes Tesla one of the world's most valuable companies, let alone one of the most valuable car automakers. That's insane. It is now worth more than Ford and any other automaker in the industry. Now, if Tesla stock remains at $1,485, after the stock split, Tesla shares will be worth $297. Now, if any of you follow Elon on Twitter, you know that he's very active there. And someone actually suggested this stock split back in June. And they actually said, any thoughts on stock split so that more fans can become investors? How about say $420 entry? And Elon responded, worth discussing an annual shareholders meeting. And in case you're wondering why they suggested a $420 entry, that's because Elon tweeted that he was considering taking Tesla private at $420 and had funding secured, which then got him in trouble with the US Securities and Exchange Commission and later accused Musk of security fraud. But then they all settled their differences and moved on. Since then, Tesla shares have been going up and down and very volatile until this past year where they have been skyrocketing. So here's what's great about the stock split. It's gonna make a lot more retail investors more interested in Tesla shares because a $300 price per share stock is gonna be more attractive than a $1,500 stock from Tesla. But even though investors can still buy fractional shares or buy an ETF that holds Tesla, there's still that psychological move of just owning one complete share of a company. Now, keep in mind that the stock split will also not impact the S&P 500 decision as the absolute share price will not really matter. So now here's why it shouldn't matter if you wait to buy Tesla shares or just decide to buy them now. Now, the split itself has no impact on the company market capitalization whatsoever. After the split, if you buy Tesla, you'll own five times as many shares or roughly pre-stock split. So whether you buy Tesla stock now or whether you buy Tesla stock two months from now doesn't really make a difference because again, we are expecting long-term returns. If you're investing in these companies, you have to know that you are in it for the long haul. If you like where Apple is going in the next 10 to 12 years, if you like where Tesla is going in the next 
10 to 15 years, then it should not matter what the price is in the next few days, the next few weeks, or the next few months. Now, I know that there are probably a lot of arguments over whether a stock split helps or hurts an investor. Now, one side says that a stock split is a good buying indicator, signaling the company's share price is increasing and doing very well. Now, while this may be true, a stock split simply has no effect on the fundamental value of the stock and poses no real advantage to investors. Now, it is without a doubt that Tesla has been increasing in value over time and has produced some crazy returns for a lot of investors, but a stock split should not be the primary reason for buying a company's stock. While there are many psychological reasons why companies split their stock, it doesn't change any of the business fundamentals. So we do have to remember that. And we also have to remember that the split has no effect on the company's worth as it is measured by the market cap of the company. Now, in the end, whether you have two $50 bills or a single $100 bill, you do actually end up having the same amount in the bank. So I would not stress too much about the stock split. Do not worry about buying it now or buying it later because at the end of the day, we are looking for that long-term outlook of the stock and the company. And as we all know, Tesla and Elon Musk have produced crazy good returns for investors. So remember that Tesla stock may still be very volatile and that number will change. So whether you decide to buy Tesla shares now or Tesla shares later, it should not matter. But if you currently don't own any Tesla shares, then that stock split may actually be a huge benefit to you because not that many people have $1,500 to buy one Tesla stock. So if it does fall under $300, that's gonna make it very, very attractive to a lot of the new investors trying to get into the market. Because as we all know, the key to investing is buying shares whenever you can and always looking for that long-term outlook. So whether you decide to buy Tesla shares now or later after the stock split, it should work out well, as long as Tesla has a dominance in the electric vehicle industry which I'm sure they will. And in case you don't know, I'm very long-term Tesla. I am bullish Tesla. And just remember that before investing, always do your own research. If you're on the long-term here, you shouldn't really care about the price now or the price after the stock split, but it will make it more attractive to new retail investors trying to get into the market. So let me know what you guys plan on doing on the comments down below. Are you gonna be investing in Tesla for the first time? Are you already holding Tesla shares and plan on buying more after the stock split happens? Let me know down in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to do your own research and think long term. Thank you guys again. Until next time. Now, if you want two free stocks, you can actually use the link down in the description below. Webull is going to be giving you two free stocks when you deposit $100 in the platform and one of those stocks will be valued up to $1,400. So if you want two free stocks, use the link down below in the description and let me know which two stocks you get. Again, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time.